Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name's Jason Newland. This is Stress and Pain Relief Podcast. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. So what we're going to do today is pretty much like we do all the time is focus on a particular part of your body or it could be your head it could be a part that's you feel the most sort of stressed or the most physical discomfort if it's chronic pain that you're listening for So I'd like you to pick a part of your body, just one. And I realise there may be more than one part of your body that's causing you problems. Like, for example, I've got lower back issues and I've also got a shoulder issue uh, with chronic pain. So in this instance, I would just focus on one of those. Now... You probably already know this, but you know, once you, once one part of your body starts to relax, feel calmer, let go, the other parts seem to just follow, I guess, like sheep, really. And that's not, I know sometimes people use that terminology being like a sheep as if it's negative, but sheep are lovely, all fluffy and cute. So it keeps them safe, doesn't it? By following their friends and their families and, you know, keeping everyone together. And the body's almost very similar to that. So, for example, if I was to focus on my shoulder and to reduce the stress or the tension in my shoulder, then my lower back is also going to notice that. My lower back is going to want want to experience that feeling of comfort and release. So we're just going to focus on one part. So I'd like I'm going to ask you to choose for yourself which part of your body you're going to focus on. And all we're going to do, all we're going to do in this recording is we're going to be nice to that part. Now this is something that's on some level <laughs> very weird, very very strange thing to do. Not something that we're generally raised to even consider doing. But we're going to do that here. We're going to be nice to that part of our body. Not physically, in a sense, because obviously we can have massages, maybe have a sauna, uh, sunbathe, I don't know, uh, jacuzzi, various physical treatments that can be lovely for the body to help to relax and reduce any kind of discomfort that may have been there before instead of that we're going to do it with words we're going to be nice to that part of your body that you're focusing on and I'm going to ask you to repeat after me certain short sentences 
or kind words that we're going to direct at that particular part of your body that you're focusing on now. Before we do this, I'd like you to just notice what level you would class it in a, on a level of discomfort from one to 10, 10 being, I guess the worst it could be, one being pretty much nothing. Just notice where it is right now. And maybe compare that to where it was five minutes ago. Notice any changes in how that part of your body feels different just by having decided to let go of that discomfort to open your mind up to more relaxation, healing and calmness just by pressing the play button and listening to my voice and now we're going to move on and I'm going to ask you to continue throughout this recording to focus on that one part of your body and the first thing we're going to do is thank it say thank you because all of the parts of our body do something to help us. Legs, arms, hands, eyes, chest. I mean, probably men's nipples are probably one part that doesn't seem <laughs> to have any necessary purpose. But they can still... I guess give pleasure um, so pretty much every part of our body has a purpose and every part gives us something provides us with a service so what we can do as you focus on that one part of your body, start by saying thank you. And I'm going to say thank you five times. And I'm going to say it and then I'd like you to repeat by focusing on that part of your body and saying it. Really mean it. You know, really mean it. And you don't have to say it out loud. You can say it internally. Um, you know, because you might be sitting on a train or on a bus or, you know, you probably not going to want to be sort of out loud saying thank you to you. You know, people might give you some looks, but it's up to you what you do. You might make some new friends. Yay. So as you focus on that part of your body. I'm going to say thank you. I'm going to focus on my lower back. I want to say thank you to my lower back. And before I do that, let me focus on my lower back and get an idea of where it is. Because it's had a bit of discomfort today, more than normal. Um, not sh quite sure why. Um, so... I'd probably say it's about a four, a five maybe. Discomfort, probably four. So on the scale of one to ten, it's a four. It's not, it's not a problem, but it's a four. So it's definitely more noticeable today than it was yesterday. That might be because I haven't done as many stretching exercises as I normally do but hey so I'm going to start and I'm going to say it five times 
And then after every time that I say it, I'd like you to focus on your part of your body and just say thank you. Really mean it. And notice how you feel emotionally when you say thank you to that part. So starting now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now the next sentence is going to be, I appreciate all that you do for me. Because every part of your body does something for you. It assists you. It serves you and has done your whole life. Each part of your body has a purpose. And it may not seem as if it has an obvious purpose, but it may be a muscle that's supporting another larger part of your body. So, again, as we focus on that part that you decided to focus on, five times, I'll say it first. I appreciate everything you do for me. I appreciate everything that 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 you do for me. going to do a different sentence this time 
directed again at that part of your body. The sentence is going to be, I care about you. I care about you. And I'm going to say it five times, starting now. Focusing on that part of my body. I care about you. I care about you. message that we're going to give to that part of your body is I love you now this may at first, it seemed like a bit of a weird thing to be saying to a, a body part. But it's probably less weird after all the other things that we've said. So no matter how unusual it may feel, let's just do it anyway. And notice how you feel. Notice how that body part feels as you say the words five times. I love you. And I'm going to start now. And you can just repeat after me. Focus in on that body part. I love you. I love 
love you. I love you. I love you. Now notice what number you would give it on a scale of 1 to 10. Now, after having said those kind words to that body part, Notice how relaxed you feel, not just in that body part, but in your mind. And the rest of your body. And you can repeat these words as often as you choose. And the more often you say them, the more powerful the positive effects manifest within you. So that you feel so much more relaxed more often more of the time happier and calmer and healthier. Letting go of everything. I'd like you to repeat ten more times the words, I love you, to that part of your body. Ten more times. And I'm going to leave you to do that. To feel relaxed and calm. Loose and peaceful. 